All right, so we need to unmute myself. All right, welcome everyone to the Tuesday edition of Season 6, Week 2 of Condor. I'm starting out today with Mayuma vs. Steak. And a little stat, some stats about both of our players here. Mayuma is, has a record of 3-3 three and three with an average win of 11 minutes, 15 seconds, with a best win of 9 minutes and 10 seconds. Steak has the exact same uh, record, 3-3, three and three, but has an average win of 8.43 and a best win of 7.54. So Steak putting up some quicker numbers here. It should be an interesting race, to say the least. And uh, if you want to get all country pride about it, we got um, Japan versus uh, Europe. <laughs> so it should be a good match. And we got our seed generated, and we are going to be going to the start soon. There it is. Early bat cave with a purple chest. Oh, welcome to Earth. Denmark, that's right. I forgot a second where Copenhagen was. Because <laughs> I'm an ignorant American. But uh, that's a good spell for both of our racers here. Going to be a nice okay, start. Oh, hello. Who is this? Hello? Yeah, what's up, Revelize? Revelize. Hello. Get in it. Uh... Here we are. I just heard voices in my ears and I got scared. <laughs> <laughs> and that is not a fun blood shop here. Gonna get a quick torch for my Yuma. Stake taking the uh, Infernal. Infernal versus Glass. I think I'm going Infernal on this. Yeah, I would too. Stake taking the, taking the time to check that, and it is a food shop. Getting all that health early on is going to be very beneficial. I can do some blood earths. <laughs> blood earth. There's a good earth spell by stake, but Moyuma's cleaning up uh, deep blues here. We're gonna maybe see a purple chest with that base axe. No, it went black. Oh, phasing dagger. You can earth and then attack through the earth. Yeah. <laughs> but not really. Unfortunately, um,. Stake was, or stake was behind, so like Moyuma couldn't afford black to be good because uh, stake was able to RNT, is able to RTMP what that chest is. And stake getting uh, some sunglasses to get two damage oh, onto that base. He did check purple. Yeah, he did check purple. Gets fireball. Oh. You know, Moyuma finds a good shot. Heavy plate kills for it. Gonna transmog a uh, ring here? Or, uh, that's not transmog. Conjure. <laughs> Con ring of pain. Dagger. Uh, facing dagger is pretty good. Oh! <laughs> Going too hard on the pain! The boots of pain? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. That's unfortunate death. After getting that heavy plate too, you think you're like safe from everything, and then it's like, oh no, you're dead. Stake gonna do the same thing. It's gonna. It would kill him too. <laughs> oh, he doesn't do it. Oh. He, he had that two space buffer. <laughs> <laughs> had time to pull up on the uh, the stick. <laughs> so we're gonna see some stake slow play here, perhaps.
Six gonna be looking for some sort of uh, health regen here. Probably gonna pop that holy water on a conga line. Yeah, might be tricky to get a the max heal with the axe though. Oh, that's right. He's just killing everything. <laughs> you need the uh, grenade charm to activate on your holy water. You just throw it. That'd be cool. <laughs> Holy water charm, and then just throw a holy water. <laughs> oh, that's fake a nice darkness. It's yeah, double hearts. <laughs> Solid. Not a gun, but uh, double hearts. Good find. I feel like the shrine of darkness is like the poor man's urn. They never did make other, or they they made the art for other shrine mimics, but they didn't like put them in the game. It's unfortunate. Stake motoring through that zone three down to uh, Fortissimole. Oh, oh my God. down again on the run back, and this is. Pretty sealed up for uh, Stake as long as it doesn't die here. Could, okay. <laughs> so I could take that for a bunch of purple hearts, but I'm gonna pass. I mean, wouldn't synergize too bad with uh, the heavy plate, but every time you take a hit, you, you're gonna lose that heart instead. Surprise, he hasn't popped the holy water yet. For any healing. There's a back cave. Could be good there. Not even got. Oh wait, killed the shopkeep, so I'm not gonna check that. Oh, it's war if you want it. Fine with pain though. Pain is also a very solid ring. Looks like he's just going to try to motor through and uh, finish the seed. Get on to the next one. <laughs> oh, that is a vault, not a potion. Could have a potion in it. That's quite the uh, um, spike trap layout there, too. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting spike traps there. Oh, oh he's just going to take kill out the vault. The vault. <laughs> That's, that doesn't look like a potion. I think it's a bow. Oh, it's oh, a blunderbuss. <laughs> No thanks. <laughs> well, you might get in that earth kill. I like it. Oh, there's an urn and a wall pick right next to it. You can open that pretty easily. Oh, that could have been bad. Almost got dunked by a... <laughs> oh, welcome to Earth, oh, Urn! <laughs> That's an obsidian axe, but you kill everything on one pile, so he can't really take Oh, everything. yeah, has to kind of shuffle through. He's forced to take a bomb spell with her. Down to zone five. Muyuma sporting a lot more health after finding that food shop here. Could probably push through zone two this time. Yeah, at this point, you're not running back. You're really just hoping for a death mistake. And Muyuma's gonna skip the heavy plate shop. Hmm. Maybe forgot I was there. Maybe. Definitely could kill for it. Eight bombs plus their spell. It's gonna switch from the phasing dagger to glass right here. I mean, when when you're this far behind, you just want like the kind of slow play and not die. Because your only hope is your enemy dying. 
Right, and with all the health and armor that Stake has, it's really, we're hoping for Dorian to die. Yeah. Or something going really wrong out here on Dead Ringer. <laughs> I was watching Stake uh, practice earlier today, and he was doing some interesting Dead Ringer shenanigans, but I think he was just goofing around. <laughs> Goes for the limit here. Needs to drop a beat, or... Goes that way, it's also fine. Still hasn't used the holy water this whole time. Not really a big deal now with all the hearts he has, but before he had like one and a half hearts. Yeah, right. Stake doing the uh, no holy water percent. We're on phase two of Necrodancer, one hit already gone. First round looks like it's all stake here. Yeah, just double death from Moyuma. Stake can just low play all he wants at that point. There's the last hit. Sub 10. GG! Nine fifty five in game and uh ten oh seven race time. Very good uh very good very good times. <laughs> Need to give stake his loot. Nope. Nope. Those are not the same seats. Yeah, those aren't. Oh, there we go. There it is. Yeah, these days I just use the copy paste thing that it's Mac made. So it's so good. good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Before, I like, I just like triple check and make sure that my seed's right. <laughs> <laughs> When when he first made it, I was just like, "Ah, eh, that's yeah, I don't need to use that." But <laughs> after I downloaded it, it's like, "Oh, it's so it's so relaxing, and I don't have to stress about putting in my seed anymore." <laughs> yep. It's like we took some different directions here. Ooh, Stake finding a really different. leather armor, but Moyuma's Moyuma gonna get that bloodshot. Potential bloodshot. If this is really good, it's really bad for Stake. Oh, it's pretty it's bad. It's not a good blood shop. <laughs> Gonna take that glass uh, torch again. But stake's already on 1 3. Yeah, it's trap door. Trap door. Oh, there's a, there's a chest in that back cave. Let's see what it is. The dragon trying to camouflage in with those red bats. Oh, it's a titanium, titanium cat. cat. Solid. Oh! oh. <laughs> Flame goes down. Bathe in fire. <laughs> so playing catch up again on Muyuma's side. But he does know not to check the blood shop this time. Goes the different way. Gets the leather armor instead. And it's relatively quick down to uh, the coral rift fight here with all those trap doors. Yeah, it's an early death, so Stake doesn't have that much time to shop or anything. Purple is war. Not great with cat, but as a damage up. Can open crates and oh, such. Hey, that's a lot better. That is a lot better. It oh, is... and there's darkness. <laughs> I think you go back for war and hit darkness. Uh, that's what he's doing. It's going to cost him a heart, but, you know, that's totally worth it. <laughs> yeah. Especially since your opponent died early, you have time to do this. Only dark just for a little bit. Just like the eclipse coming up on the 21st, I think. Maybe? I, I wish I could see it, but I am not close enough to, so I haven't really been following that much. I don't think I am either. <laughs> Sad face. Oh, there's a torch. I mean, usually you don't want a torch on a darkness, but torch of strength. Okay, I take it. Now you have the three damage to open crates and stuff. I could take those ears too for even more damage. Is that a five damage cat plus pain? Yeah. Pretty much everything dies around you. I one shot that.
Look like uh, Moyuma's gonna do the same thing here. Hit the Shrine of Darkness and go back, get that pain. And stake down to Death Metal. Well, Yuma could push here and uh, catch up with Steak, um, especially if Steak keeps going to these shops here. But, I mean, <laughs> the shop with a Mimic right to uh, your uh, your mini boss helps a lot. Yep. Takes a hit there, but does have the heal spell, so it's fine. Doesn't have the best armor in the world, only leather. Well, Yuma's Leprechaun got away from him on uh, the last floor there, so no luck. Oh, Stake found a courage shovel. And really pushed through that zone 3, already on Fortissimal. He pushed really fast, but with the cat, it can also get kind of weird with the courage shovel. You get snagged on things you might not want to. It's like a potion in uh, the 4 1 here. Along Plenty with a bombs. bunch of bombs. bombs now. <laughs> and a blast oh, home? Why not? Go great. <laughs> great with that 12, now 15 bombs. <laughs> Yeah, this is a very fast seed. Already sub 5 to 4 3. Let's go blow up the Pixie. I'm not going to take damage because of Blast Helm. No Pixie Kisses today. Oh, good shield spell. Right in that dragon's face. Boom is catching up decently. Down to 4 2. And King Kong on zone 4 is kind of uh, a boss that's going to slow you down, too, unless you're doing some type of uh, Mayuma strat or uh, Azuma strat. My bad. <laughs> Freudian <laughs> slip there. <laughs> um, the, the blast home can't even, though. Oh, right. Just going to have to blow up the uh, the uh, chair. The throne? Mayuma, Mayuma doesn't have a blast home, so he can and should do the Azuma here. Although it's shouldn't, I don't think it one shots um, King Kong of four. No, it does not, which makes makes the strat a little more awkward. Like stakes pushing through this zone five, taking a hit or two. Doesn't really matter with all that healing and tow, cookies, heal spell, potion. Already down to 5-3 exit stairs, but Mayuma is going down to 5-2 shortly after this dragon. Right side dead ringer spawn, uh, doing a doing a stake strat. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna call it stake strat. I don't know what this is, but <laughs> this is, maybe he does. <laughs> this is the no Hopefully. strat. <laughs> Hopefully he does. All right, manages to uh, get it done. And even as the blast home speed does this up, Moyuma now has found a, neck, a dead ringer though. So run back caught, caught up pretty close. Yeah, an excellent push. Moyuma's gonna have to tank some bombs here to try to uh, speed up the phase two Necrodancer. But stake might be done by then. Already four hits on the Necrodancer. Yeah, two left. One left. Oh. And he gets it. Looks like a sub 30. Really solid time. Yeah, great time. That is definitely going to make the fastest list. And 2 0 going for stake. 
Yeah, but really good run back by Mayuma too. That was 6.30 in the Necrodancer for him. Alright, got our next seed. We'll get the third race going here. Net puts stake in the one, two, three, four, five, six, eighth position for fastest. Monkey paw. We're gonna have some frozen monkeys on this run. No telemonkeys allowed. Oh, blood shop. Lena's gonna take uh, the quartz armor and torch. But stake takes the the gold axe instead. I really like the gold axe because you can lunge onto your uh, your uh, pile of gold that you just killed, and then you're doing a, a three. Uh, three times infinite damage kill. Your next attack feels real good. Oh, Ring of Regen. The one, two purple chest. Regen and extra heart for take here. But Mayuma finding a trapdoor is going to move on to one, three a little bit sooner than stake. Boss Shrine on 1-3. That could really be, could be really good for stake here with this gold axe. Three damage axe. There's the gold kill. Uh, I don't think... Stake, stake didn't even see it. Yeah, didn't see it. Mayuma didn't take oh, it. No. That could have been really good for stake, depending on what this black chest is. For, uh, Mayuma. It's Titanium Raper. Stake actually gets there first and checks black. Oh, and just finds Shriner with the war right after. <laughs> <laughs> Both of our racers picking up the Titanium Rapier and moving forward a uh, gold scroll in the purple chest can't can't win all the the purple chest rolls here <laughs> and going down these stairs about the same time yeah pretty really close race now oh there's courage with with the uh, lead boots Stake not gonna take the courage. Probably feeling a little safer with the uh, ring of regen. Rapier courage becomes a lot safer when you have the lead boots because then you're not sliding on the ice. Right, you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> no slip and slides. Oh, Mayuma finding a really good spell in their deep blues uh, purple chest there. And now, now this they're really about to push hard with regen uh, freeze. Take that try to rhythm, count to seven. Until the end of time. Excellent freeze for Mayuma. Mayuma's gonna try to push this lead here. Finding a lot of the early trap doors in zone three. Stake's just gonna freeze to get to the trap door. He has a call rift. Should be easy blood freeze here. Go. Yep. And uh, purple chest check again. I might skip the chest. That's what Stake's gonna do and take the Stake's lead. He's gonna skip. No finds pulse. Decent. Mm -hmm. 
Moyo almost goes right instead of up and finds a bomb, and now they're even on bombs here. But still under the threshold of three. Need one more. Use that pulse. There it is. Good job, Mayuma. I like the introduction of uh, pulse in the season six here. It seems like almost maybe a couple people are pretty comfortable with it, but a lot of people seem to uh, still uh, miss a lot of pulse attacks, which is super entertaining. <laughs> oh, I love pulse. I'm pretty sure there's some fancy dead ringer pulse strats that we haven't found yet. Yeah, I'm waiting for it. <laughs> But both the racers here pushing through zone 4 as quick as they can, both on each other's heels. Looks like Stakes can be first down the Verdissimal. But Moima, really close behind here. Oh, Stake does take a hit, but probably wasn't going to take the chests anyway. Yeah, dropping the beat, it's fine. Moima having a little worse for Tissimal here, a little slower, but does, does Wallace still still skips the chest anyways. Oh, can't, I think you want to conjure either Blood Shovel or Blast Helm here. He's going to go for the uh, Blood Shovel. There it is. And now we don't need those bombs. Moima's not going in. He's, he's the five armor bomb here. Could be big. Also, uh... Stake finding obsidian cat switching to that to the rapier. Oh, quake scroll! Gonna have a quick uh, dead ringer kill from Ryuma. <laughs> Glass cat in five three. No thanks. Both of our racers taking the wrong direction here to uh, the exit room, getting caught up by some skeletons. Oh, Stake is half a heart right now. Ooh, this is Spook. Very Spook. He needs to keep the health, not just to not die, but also for the blood <laughs> trouble. Right. We're going to lose that advantage. <laughs> Almost full clearing this 5-3. And we're going to be going down the dead ringer for Miyuma first. Let's see that uh. quake scroll on the door. Dead Ringer is steady. They're on the Dead Ringer dead even right now, but Stake has the fast Necro Dancer. Moyuma does not have the bombs. Gonna check a red chest here. Gets a bomb charm! Oh, bailed. Bailed. <laughs> bailed so hard! Get oh bailed! <laughs> now it looks like it's coming down the lures. <laughs> Necro Dancer freed first for Moyuma, but Stake has the first hit with Blood, uh, blood Shovel. And getting a good teleport right away gets a second hit. He also only, um, Cadence also has one heart, so could get dunked at any point. One hit left for Stake. Oh, uh, looks like that's gonna do it. <laughs> yeah, Very close Stake's space. gonna get it. Wow, amazing finish there. Another sub 8 run for Stake. In just over eight minutes for Mayuma. Yeah, that that one conjure really did it. Conjure the blood shovel. Got the first hit on Necro Dancer there. GG's all around. Three out, but really close each time. Other than, well, I should say the first, the second two races. First one was 